Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are set to skip the Super Bowl despite receiving a personal invitation. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have been invited to tonight's Super Bowl by NFL bosses, but it looks like they will decline the offer ahead of a big trip. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss anything about the British royal family. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle may have received a personal invitation to tonight's Super Bowl, but it looks like they're about to turn it down. Sources have told the Mirror that NFL bosses have invited the Duke of Sussex to watch the San Francisco match against the Kansas City Chiefs. The invitation comes after Harry was presented with an award at the NFL Honors on Thursday night. An NFL insider said, the prince is known to love American football, and bosses extended an invitation to him after his appearance at the awards ceremony. This year's Super Bowl is expected to be one of the most watched matches of all time. However, it looks like Harry and Meghan may be skipping this big task before a big business trip. Sources told Page Six that Harry and Meghan will not be in Las Vegas for the Super Bowl because they are busy preparing for their trip to Canada for the opening ceremony of the Invictus Games next week. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are set to spend three days in Canada to celebrate the one-year anniversary of the 2025 Invictus Games. Harry and Meghan are scheduled to appear from February 14 to February 16 at the launch. The next Invictus Games will take place in February 2025 and will be held in Vancouver and Whistler. The Games will include winter sports for the first time. Harry created the Invictus Games in 2014 to help injured and ill veterans. He wanted to inspire recovery through sports and the challenge of adventure, according to his website. Harry is no stranger to the Super Bowl, having attended the game in 2022 with Eugenie in California. His invitation to tonight's game comes after he presented an award at the NFL Honors Gala. In his speech, he praised the players for their work. What you guys do on and off the field is truly amazing. You are an example to millions in the way you carry yourself and the way you give back, Harry said. He then welcomed Pittsburgh Steelers football player Cameron Haywood to the stage to receive the Walter Payton Man of the Year award.